Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to part two of today's stream. We're playing some more Final Fantasy VII. Hello, Eminem, hello. It's not loud. Turn your sound down. Turn your sound down. It's not loud. I can see in the thing. Okay, you guys, I'm ha it took a minute because I had to make a snack. I, uh, I think I shared with you guys less last week. I'm completely addicted to Uncrustables. And, and guess what this is? This is a, an, an Uncrustable that I put in the air fryer. And it's Nutella filled, basically. It's Nutella filled. It's Nutella filled. Oh, the cat video was loud. Oh, okay. I gotcha. <clears throat> I gotcha. How are you doing today, Eminem? How are you doing today? All right. Let's get back into it. It's time to go to Cosmo Canyon. It's time to go to Cosmo Canyon. Okay. We're going to get back in our buggy and we're going to zoom, zoom. You're craving for that Sonic 3 trailer? Well, Blue, you love Sonic. You love Sonic, so that makes sense to me. You're good? I'm so glad, Eminem. I'm so glad. I was a hater. Okay, I was an Uncrustables hater. I was. And I'm here to tell you guys, I was so wrong. Oh, that gives me haste. Okay. I was so wrong to hate on the Uncrustables. They're delicious. I was just dumb, okay? I was just dumb thinking like, why would I have that? A, a crustless, frozen peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Why would I have that? I could just make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I was dumb. I was dumb and I was wrong and they're amazing. It's amazing. I wanna hear Keanu Reeves' shadow already. <laughs> I think we all do, Blue. I mean, you know, I'm, I don't, I'm not like big into Sonic or anything, but I have enjoyed the Sonic movies that they have put out lately. So I will watch the next one, you know? I'll watch the next one, because I have enjoyed it. Um, the Sonic movies is good shit. These are so delicious. Okay, and this one is freaking Nutella. Like the heck, I slept on these for years. Encrustables have existed for like a decade or something. And I was just like, mm, I'm above it, I'm mm, whatever, you know? Oh, let's see what Titan looks like. I was dumb, you guys, I was dumb. Pretty delicious. Ooh, Anger of the Land. I go by every day just praying the trailer drops already. Well, hopefully you will get your wish soon, Blue. I mean, I'm definitely gonna watch it. For sure. They are good films. They are. You know, there's just, there's, you know, you can just tell when there's a lot of love put in something. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Okay. Okay. I am home. It is I, Nanaki. Hey, Nanaki, you're safe. Come on and say hel hello to Bugenhagen. The silliest fucking name. Bugenhagen, what the? Nanaki? It's Nanaki. Welcome to Cosmo Canyon. Are you familiar with this land? No. Let me explain. People from all over the world gather here to seek and study, to seek the study of planet life. Uh, I'm sorry, it's full now, so you can't, I can't let you enter. They helped me when I was on the road. Please let them in. Oh, is that so? You helped out Nanaki? Please come in. Yes. Who is Nanaki? Nanaki is Nanaki, that's his name. Okay, all right. Okay. Um, let's, uh... Let's put Tifa in the party. Did Red run off with all of his materia? Probably. Probably. Yeah, he totes did. He totes did. Because I don't have nothing. I don't have nothing. Nah.
Guess I can just put stuff on there to, you know, improve her stats. Uh... Get some alls. Uh, let's do... Okay. Alright. Whoa, Cosmo Canyon. Yeah, Nanaki! Nanaki's back! It's all thanks to this flame! What? This is the fire called Cosmo Canyon. It's burned for generations. It's a holy flame that protects this canyon. I've heard it only went out once, long ago. The elder said something horrifying occurred, but really, I don't know much else about it. Wow. Whoa! Don't scare me like that, I almost fell over! Sorry, my dude. Frozen Nutella. Okay. And you can toast it. Why did I sleep on these? You have never tried an uncrustable. Go out and fix that today. Is that so? You brought Nanaki back here? Yeah, thanks. Welcome. How about our original cocktail, Cosmo Candle? A drink now and then is good for you. It'll relax you a bit. If you know when to stop. That's true. Yeah. You already had a scoop of Nutella? Well, you, good. Good, Blue. What the heck he is in here? Looks like fun, but I don't know what this is. Like an absolute kindergarten kid. It's good for you sometimes, Blue. Time to go figure out what's in a Cosmo cocktail. I'm sure someone has made a recipe for that on the internet, and you could make one for your Final Fantasy drinking. Welcome to Shildra Inn. It'll be a hundred gill a night. Would you like to stay? Well then, please come again. Okay. Oh, it's just the room. Okay. Oh, here it is. Okay. I was like, there's supposed to be a turtle's paradise. It's right here. Number five. Our cocktails are good, but our wine is the best. Please stop in at the turtle's paradise. Okay. It's number five. Oh, wait, there was an item in there, too. Yeah, it's the Omega shirt. It sure is. Okay, an elixir. There's an elixir in that barrel. Yeah, you can get yours on Barbara Monger t-shirts. Let me put in a link. Yeah. This one, this place, you can get them. I know I scared that guy, I didn't mean to. I just was trying to talk to him, but he got scared. Can I not, can I not, okay. I was like, can I not walk up there? I can walk up there. <laughs> Mods are sleeping posting links in chat. <laughs> Mods are sleeping post links. Post links, mods are sleeping. Hello, looking for anything in particular? Uh, okay, this is items. What's back there? I want to go back there. I see, I see green, but I can't go back there. There's all these things we can climb up and there's no green, but there's nothing up here. Okay, that was pointless. This way. I guess we'll actually go where Nanaki went. Go on, up the stairs, there we go. Here is where I was. I mean, this is my hometown. My tribe were protectors of those who appreciate this beautiful canyon and the planet. My brave mother fought and died here, but my cowardly father left her. I am the last of my race. Cowardly father? Yes, my father was a wastrel. And so, the mission I inherited from my ancestors is to protect this place.
My journey ends here. Hey, Nanaki, you're home. Oh, it's that's his grandpa. Oh, hey, Nanaki, you're home. <laughs> Would be better. Come in, Grandpa. <laughs> Let's rest for a bit. There are some things I want to find out about anyway. The middle bite's the best. Nanaki, more like Nanaki bees. <laughs> oh, Cloud by himself. Oh, his Turtles Paradise number four. Now hiring, looking for someone who can stand long hours of boredom. For details, contact the Turtles Paradise. Oh, welcome. The people of this canyon hate to compete, so it's almost everything here are replicas. But that's all right. Some of them you can really use. Oh man, why did I grind? There's even better ones here. Let's definitely get this. Man. Okay, we're gonna have to grind for more gold. Or gill, sorry. Should have bought Cloud's one. There's always a bigger fish, I mean weapon, yeah. I shouldn't have I shouldn't have grinded to buy them. It was a waste. That's okay. We'll grind more. It's helpful anyways because getting us levels too. Where did I put it? I know it's around here. Can I help you find it? I don't see anything in here. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what he's trying to find. Hug and seal this door shut. How do you do that with super glue? <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I'm so busy. I need more help. Oh. Yeah. Get that kid to help you. That's free labor right there. Oh, I'm like all the way back. I don't think I can go anywhere. Bugenhangen has that Gorilla Glue power? Yeah, probably. That's such a beautiful shot right there. Can I climb up here? Yes. Bugenhangen is such a silly name. Why is that his name? Like, I can't. Why isn't it your name? Why isn't it your name? Dragon. It could be. It could be. It could be. Here we go. Cloud. This is my grandfather, Bugen. He is incredible. He knows everything. Ho 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 ho. I hear that you looked after Nanaki. Nanaki is still a child, you see. Please stop, grandfather. I am 48. Ho ho ho. Nanaki's tribe has incredible longevity. So you see, his 48 years would only be the equivalent to, say, that of a 15 or 16 year old in human reckoning. 15 or 16? He's quiet and very deep. You thought he was an adult. Grandfather, I want to be an adult. I want to grow up and be able to protect you and the village. Ho ho ho. No, Nanaki, you can't stand on your own yet. To do that now would destroy you in the long run. Reaching up to the heavens, threatening to snatch the very stars from the great city of Midgar. You've seen it, haven't you? Well, that's a bad example. Looking up too much makes you lose perspective. When it's time for the planet to die, you'll understand that you know absolutely nothing. When the planet dies? Oh, it may be tomorrow or 100 years from now, but it's not long off. How do you know this? I hear the cries of the planet. Well, 
What's that? The sound of the stars in the heavens. While this goes on, planets are born and die. What was that? Ho oh, ho ho! That was a scream from the planet. Didn't you hear it? As if to say I hurt, I suffer. They have come here on a journey to save the planet. Why don't you show them your apparatus? Ho oh, ho! To save the planet? Ho oh, ho! But then again, I guess it wouldn't hurt to show them. Bugenhagen. Several odd-looking people are here. The whole place has gotten busy all of a sudden. He brought friends too. I'll go get them. Oh, I guess we're the strange-looking people. Cloud, please call one of them. Only three people can fit in Grandfather's machine. Don't worry, my machine won't run away. Go and invite your friends. Oh, I guess I have to leave. It's gonna make me go all the way back out. What the heck? I already had Tifa and Eris in my party. Oh, there's Yuffie. God, I hate studying! You're currently regretting the Nutella? I'm almost done with mine, no regrets. But there's not like a ton in here, it's just a little bit. Okay, I got Tifa and Eris. Here, over here, the door's unlocked, come in. Oh, ho, ho. it looks like you have them all together then, let's begin. I'll stand there. So pretty. It's just like the real thing. Yes. Pretty good. This is my laboratory. All the workings of space are entered into the 3D holographic system. Hey, a shooting star! Yes, it is something, isn't it? Well, let's get to the subject. Eventually, all humans die. What happens to them after they die? The body decomposes and returns to the planet. That much everyone knows. What about their consciousness, their hearts, and their souls? This soul, too, returns to the planet. And not only those of humans, but everything on this planet, in fact. All living things in the universe are the same. The spirits that return to the planet merge with one another and roam the planet. They roam, converge, and divide, becoming a swell called the life stream. Life stream, in other words, a path of energy of the souls roaming the planet. Spirit energy is a word that you should never forget. A new life, children are blessed with spirit energy and are brought into this world. Then, the time comes when they die and once again return to the planet. 
course, there are exceptions, but this is the way of the world. I've digressed, but you'll understand better if you watch this. energy is the source of life for trees, birds, and humans. And not only living things, it makes it possible to form planets. And if that spirit energy were to disappear, These are the basics of the study of planet life. Spirit energy disappears, our planet will die. Ho ho, spirit energy is efficient because it exists within nature. When spirit energy is forcefully extracted and manufactured, it can't accomplish its true purpose. You're talking about Mako energy, right? Every day, Mako reactors suck up spirit energy, diminishing it. Spirit energy is composed in reactors and processed into Mako energy. All living things are being used up and thrown away. In other words, Mako energy will only destroy the planet. The story of the planets and those who lived within with them. If you want to know more, when you must listen to the words of the elders. Okay, so... Basically, what we have learned is that all energy that goes into living things, when the living thing dies, it returns to the planet. And when new living things are born, it draws from that life energy. So, what Shinra is doing with drawing in Mako energy, or this world's version of kind of fossil fuels, right? It means that literally there is less life in the planet to be born in the future. So what we're doing here is literalizing the idea that deep extractions of energy from the core of the planet destroy the planet. Okay? This game was in the 90s okay people have been thinking about this for a very long time Nanaki his father a coward so that's it Nanaki's been thinking that all this time okay maybe Nanaki is wrong about his father Bugenhagen doesn't seem to think that he's a coward from that little line right there <clears throat> Okay, I think, I think that's it. I think I should be able to go through that stuck door now. Oh, well, maybe not. Oh, thank you so much for the follow, friendo. Thank you. Happy to have you here. Okay. No, this is just back out there. We can go this way, maybe? Oh, is this the way we go next? 
No? That's that guy that couldn't find the thing. Okay. Oh my gosh. Well, let's at least save. Yeah, I'm not trying to leave. Oh, they're around the fire. Okay, here we go. Alright, well, thank you for stopping by, Blue. I will see you later. Cloud. Bonfires are funny, aren't they? They make you remember all sorts of things. You know, Cloud, five years ago... <sighs> It's nothing. No, forget it. I'm afraid to ask. What is it? Feels like... Like you're going far away. You really, really are. You, right? Oh, that's cryptic. It is, it is, Miniki. I have not played this game since I was, um, since I was a kid, so... It's been really nice so far, redoing it as an adult. Thank you so much for the follow a minute to go, by the way. Okay. I learned a lot. The elders taught me many things about the Cetra and the Promised Land. I'm alone. I'm all alone now. But I am... We're here for you, right? Oh, that's Cloud. But I am... We're here for you, right? I know, I know, but I'm the only Cetra. Does that mean we can't help? Oh, poor Eris. I'm currently playing Final Fantasy um, V Pixel. Oh, we before this we did uh, Final Fantasy I on the Pixel Remaster. That was great. I wonder how many years it's been. Gosh, it brings back memories. What a boring place. Just like I thought. I want to go somewhere. Let's go find some materia. Oh my gosh, Yuffie. I love you, but you're so annoying. Cosmo Canyon. That's where Avalanche was born. I promised my guys someday when we save the planet from the Shinra that we'd all go to Cosmo Canyon and celebrate. Biggs, Wedge, Jesse. Now they're all gone. Died for the planet. Aww. Really? Save the planet? We all we all hate the Shinra. But is it right to go on? Will they will they ever forgive me? Right now, I don't really know. But I do know one thing. If there's anything I can do to save the planet, or the people living on it, then I'm gonna do it. I don't care if it's for justice or revenge or whatever, I don't care. Ugh, I'm gonna do it! Again, again, Avalanche is born again! Alright, Barrett. Platinum 1 through 4 so far, nice! Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna eventually go, go um, through all of them. Okay. Alright, we've talked to everybody. Is there anything else I'm supposed to do for this scene? I don't think so. Okay. Come on, Nanaki. Oh, now we're gonna talk serious, okay. Long ago, when I was still very small, we were around this flame. No, never mind. What happened? It's about my parents. When I talk about my mother, I'm full of pride and joy. And that's fine, but when I think of my father, my heart is full of anger. You really can't forgive your father? Of course, he left my mother for dead. When the G tribe attacked, he ran off by himself, leaving mother and the people of the Kenyan. Nanaki, there's something you should see. Hmm? This place may be dangerous. Cloud, will you and one other person come with us? No problem, my dude. Come on, Eris, let's go. Alright, you guys, we'll be right back. We gotta show Nanaki some real truth.
Let me make sure I've got materials and stuff equipped. Yes, okay. All right. Let's go! Oh, wrong way. But yeah, I love Final Fantasy, um, Minky. We've done 100% runs of 10, 10, 2, and Final Fantasy 1 so far. So we're on 7 now. But that's the ones we've done so far. Ho, 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 ho. Are we all set? Yeah. Shall we go? Okay. Let's go, Boogan Hagen. Undo your super glue. It's not super glue, it's just a button. All right, come in, come in. Okay, you lead the way, Grandpa. What, are you crazy? It's dangerous in there, I told you that. You want an old man like me to go first. I'll be right behind you. Okay, so we have to lead the way. All right, let's go. <clears throat> um, there is an enemy skill we can get in here uh, called Death Sentence, so hopefully we will get that. I think I should have enemy skill on red. Yes, okay, I have my enemy skill on red, okay. Let's go down. That's amazing, thank you. I love, I just love me some Final Fantasy, you know? Especially the older ones. <clears throat> All right, I guess we just go this way. There we go. Ooh, materia. Gimme. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, let's go. We're gonna, um... See, like, that sound effect when she goes into Shiva is, like, really loud, but, like, the sound effect of me just moving around the menu is, like, really quiet. So that's what I mean, like, I, like, the sound in the, in the, um, PC version of this is kind of messed up. I don't know if it's like that in all the versions. Six, seven, and nine I've played the most. Oh! Well, this is a, um, no spoilers, but backseating is okay. Stream. So, if you, you see me stuck or something, feel free to speak up if you know what's, what's up. Um, cause I'm, I'm cool with some backseating. I see a materia up there, but I can't get it. Hmm. Guess I'll have to get it later? I don't know. That looks like I should be able to walk across it. That little, that blue stuff. Poisoned? I don't think so. Maybe he stopped. <clears throat> oh, no. There he goes. too fast. What did he get? He already had his limit break. It must have been a materia upgrade. Um, okay.
Whoa, what is that? That was kind of scary. Seven has my favorite soundtrack. Seven is definitely amazing. Um, Sephiroth's, like, his theme is, like, one of the best uh, villain music themes in Final Fantasy, in my opinion. So it's, it's, it does really, really good score. Really good score. Ten is my favorite, by the way. That's why we did the 100% of that one first. Um, I love that game. But this is good. Seven was my favorite before Ten came out. Okay. I do not know where I'm going. I feel like... I have to go into these. An odd-shaped rock. Break it open. Duh. Okay. I don't know what that did. What's in here? Whoa! Oh ho ho! Everybody hears a ghost of the G tribe killed in a certain battle. A certain battle. Oh, a certain battle. The vengeful spirits of the Gi didn't disappear and couldn't return to the live stream. We still have far to go. Ho ho ho. Okay. I don't think I'm supposed to, I feel like that's the right way, so I need to go in the... Yeah, I want to break open all the rocks, I guess. Tactics has a good soundtrack, too. Yes, um, Tactics actually does have a very good soundtrack. Tactics, I did not um, understand when I was younger <laughs> how to do a... Uh, how to do like a um that type of combat um the very tactical combat and so like i didn't like it but i was wrong i, I replayed it like later like years after it came out and it's pretty good tactics advanced was really good but i didn't play either of those at the time because i didn't understand the battle system when i was little I guess, yeah, there's nothing else. I just break open the rock and like, why am I breaking open these rocks? Let's go down here into this one. Yeah, break it open. Then we'll go to the other cave to the left. <clears throat> yeah, Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy music in general is really freaking good. Really, really good. Even in the very first game, like, we just played the, the first one, and it, yes, it's remastered versions of those those songs from the original, but, um, it's, st it's great. It's still, like, really good.
Okay. So the only thing on this screen is that materia I can't figure out how to get to, I guess. Um. Come on, I'm tired of these battles. Too many battles. Run away. Okay. Alright, so I guess I'll just go the way that Buchenhagen was. Come on. Go. Oh, you can't walk that way. It's around this way. They should release an updated PC version that lets you um, turn off random battles when you want to. Thank you so much, Minnie. Or, sorry, Minki. And welcome in. Hope to see you. We're streaming again tomorrow. Hope to see you then. Uh, okay, let's try this this way when Bugenhagen popped out. Maybe this this is it, and there really wasn't anything on that screen. And I'll like come back there to get the materia and later. Materials are getting leveled up. That's awesome. Whoa! Mm. Oh, okay. Added effect? Oh! Oh my god! That thing destroyed our HP! <gasps> what? Adds materia status to equip weapon or armor. Oh, so you can like add poison, I guess, or whatever. Um, okay. Man, that destroyed me. Running into those spikes. Jesus. I'm glad I noticed. Okay. Oh, that's not on the same level. I can't walk down there. He's flashing his eyes and his eyebrows don't flash with the rest of him. Walking carefully. There we go. Oh. Wait, how do I get over there? I need a, uh, a materia to turn off random encounters. Okay. 
Where am I supposed to go? I'm gonna make sure. <laughs> oh, it's just right there. I can't get those treasure chests down there. We'll have to get down there somehow. Man, that weird, that skull is so weird. So weird looking. Okay, we're gonna use, I wanna use the, um, the white wind. I haven't shown it off yet. Oh, yay, he got it, death sentence. So that's what white wind looks like in this game. It's amazing. Best skill. Really nice to have another heal, just like using White Wind in uh, in any other in in uh, in any other Final Fantasy. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, oh, there is how to go down. Okay, come here, treasure. An ether. Let's do Matra magic on them. So it's fire Z missiles. Oh my gosh, Nanaki's gonna die. You know, one thing about this game that is so funny about this area, we have learned at this point that his real name is Nanaki, right? It's not Red. Remember, he told us at the very beginning he did not really feel attachment to his name and we could call him whatever we wanted. Um. But it doesn't give us an opportunity at this point to rename him to Nanaki and say, well, let's call him Nanaki. Um, I think that this happens because on a technical level, that's like not something that they did in the game. But I think thematically, it's also about how Nanaki does not feel attachment to his identity in any way. In fact, it almost seems like uh, he has a lot of resentment to almost everything about his identity. Um, being the last of his kind, being part of it. Um, the fact that he has so much anger about his father, uh, you know, <clears throat> from his perception being a coward. And about how he really doesn't see himself as himself. He sees himself as somebody that is supposed to go and do the things that his entire race was supposed to do. And I think that's so tragic. And the fact that you can't change his name really uh, supports that. So there's no reason for the game to give you the ability when Nanaki literally wouldn't care. 
Okay, new Kate Sith weapon. So they just, they don't. So if we apply that technical reality to what that means for the story, I think that's what we can take away from it for Nanaki. As you can see, this cave leads to the back of Cosmo Canyon. Even though the Gi outnumbered us, they could not attack through here because the passage is too narrow. Let's move on. All right. So we got a little bit of a um, we got a little bit of a, a 300 sort of situation going on here. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Okay, I have to choose one of these. Huh? Oh, that just loops around. Okay. What about this one? I like that Titan is literally just like a big hulking dude. <laughs> he just he just he's just a guy. He's just a dude guy. Oh my gosh, what the heck? What are you? Stinger, level 25, okay. Is that because there was a spider web there, so he came out and attacked me because I walked through his web? Is that what happened? He has a lot of HP, also. When I did that sense, it was a lot. Whoa! What the heck? That bomb move! That destroyed me! Okay, jeez. There we go. Goodbye. Oh, there's lots of, like, okay, chests back here. You walk through the spider webs. That's an X potion. Right here. No, I think that's going to be the exit. That's just going to take me back.
Come on, escape, you guys. Oh no, that one goes back there too. Okay, I am missing something. Because I can see how to get out of here, but I don't... I know there's more treasure, and I don't see how to get it. Okay. Okay, maybe I'm just supposed to go this way? No? This way. Oh my god, that sting bomb hurts! There we go. I was about to white wind on Red's next turn. Oh, Red needs mana! Oh, can I not? Oh, I can't do it. I can't do it outside of combat. All right. Well, there we go. Okay, it's like this. That didn't work. Oh, you know what enemy skill I haven't used yet? I haven't shown off, um, death sentence. I think it just casts death on them. Yeah, and so then it counts down. But just like in every other Final Fantasy where you can do one of these death type of spells, um, I'm pretty sure it fails a lot. Like, you can't do it on bosses and stuff like that. It's not working. I don't understand. Oh, yeah, the spider web's gone. Okay, let's 
try this again. It's got to be a way I can get down there. Yo, I am busy trying to navigate. Stop pulling me to battle. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, a fairy ring. Okay. Oh, I want that treasure. Okay. It must be another one of those, like, I have to go around... Man, everything in here casts that death sentence spell. So I guess you can really get it from, like, any of these guys. Good time for Aerist after limit break come up. On these stupid things. Turbo Ether. <clears throat> this warrior went through the cave all alone, fighting attackers one after another. Grandpa, that warrior. Ho oh, ho, we're almost there. Yeah, Nanaki, you putting it together. You putting it together. Me too. Me too. We're gonna find out the truth. What is this? Grandpa, is he? After death, the ghosts of the Gi, like stagnant air. This can't be! Oh, boss battle! Okay! Uh, big ass Gi dude, I guess. Uh, let's sense him. Oh, he's got. Okay. Oh, I should have used Lunatic High to buff everybody. <clears throat> okay, level 29, 5,500, weak against Holy. I don't think I have anything that does holy, so yeah. Unless one of my summons does, but I don't think it does. Shiva does ice.
All right, we got both of his little his little front little guys. I guess Earth stuff doesn't hit him because he's up in the air. God damn it. Okay. Whatever. Ramu will hit you. See, can he be poisoned? Yeah, that comes from on top of a mountain. Dodge this. Mr. Airman. You took Cloud's MP. Nope, he can't be poisoned. annoying he he'll drain HP and MP heal himself He doesn't have enough MP for, like, any of this. Takeover. What did that do? Like, the triangle thing went into Cloud. Cloud can still attack. Oh, it went inside him to cast fire too later. Okay. Yeah, he don't have any MP, so that didn't do nothing.
I don't know. Don't do Ifrit, because he seems like a fire guy. I bet Ifrit will, like, heal him or something stupid. How much HP he got left? He dead. We did it, you guys. Climb hazard. Thank you, Cloud. Because of you, we survived. Nanaki, you've grown strong too. Oh, yeah? Now, I know that it wasn't a mistake to bring you here. Come, I have something I want to show you right over here. I got some materia. Ooh, gravity materia. What was that thing I got? Oh, I got wiser staff, but where's the other one? I had something else. I don't know. Whatever. We'll find it later. Let's continue the story. Let's go, you guys. This is... The warrior who fought against the Gi. He kept them from taking even one step into Cosmo Canyon. But he was never able to return to town. Look, Nanaki. Look at your father, at the warrior Seto. That's Seto. Seto continued to fight the Gi tribe here to protect this canyon. Even after the Gi's poisonous arrows turned his body to stone, even after they all ran away, Seto continued to protect us. And he continues to protect us, even now. Even now. You thought that he was a coward and ran away, but he alone risked his life to protect Cosmo Canyon. That is your father, Seto. That is Seto. Did Mother know? Oh, she knew. The two of them made me promise to keep this cave shut. They asked me to seal, my, seal it myself and not tell a soul. They said we should forget about this cave. Cloud, would you mind leaving the two of us alone? Come on, Eris. You don't hang around either. There we go. Nanaki, I want you to continue your journey with Cloud and the others. Grandpa! Listen, Nanaki. Cloud says they are trying to save the planet. Honestly, I don't think it can be done. For even if they stop every reactor on the planet, it's only going to postpone the inevitable. Even if they stop Sephiroth, everything will perish. But, Nanaki, I've been thinking lately. I've been thinking if there was anything we could do as a part of the planet. Something to help a planet already in misery. No matter what happens, isn't it important to try? Am I just wishing against fate? I am too old to do anything about it. This year I'll be 130. <laughs> Holy shit, that's old. I didn't, the humans in this world can live to 130? My god. That is why, Nanaki, you must go with them for my sake. Grandpa. I wanted to show you your real father before you left. I'm so glad that you came back while I was still alive to show you. Grandpa, don't talk like that. I don't want to think of life without you. Ho oh, ho, well, I've had a long life. Grandpa, you must live. I'll see to it. I'll see to what's happening to the planet. And, you'll, and I'll come back to tell you. Nanaki. 
I am Nanaki of Cosmo Canyon, the son of the warrior Seto. I'll come back a true warrior to that noble name. So please, Grandpa. That's Seto's... Seto... Father... Shall we get going? So this is... it. Red 13. That's just the way it goes. You came in handy at times. I'm not going to leave him. We're going back. It's up the silly ladder. Oh my god, they're not here! it's locked again. How does he seal it with a huge magnet? Could be, you never know. But it's just a button, kid. Sorry. I can't teach you because it actually is kind of dangerous back there. Lots of monsters. Dang, well, I guess we're gonna look at the weapon shop. What do you call a fake Catwoman? I don't know. What do you call a fake Catwoman, Eminem? Tell me, tell me. A copycat. <laughs> That's true. That's true. <laughs> That's a good one, Eminem. keep that wiser staff because it has double materia growth. I haven't really been paying attention to that, but I should have been. So I need to keep that force stealer and the wiser staff. If 
I can sell that. Okay, well I bought some weapons when we go outside of this area. I will uh, equip them. There we go. Okay, I just had to try to leave. <laughs> Wait for me, I'm coming too. Huh? Yeah, Bugenhagen convinced him. Cloud, please look after Nanaki. What happened? I think I grew up a little. That's what happened. So Nanaki's just a kid. He's even younger than a lot of them in some ways. Aw, uh, so cute. Okay, let's, um... Let's, uh, do some equipping. Oh, wait. Seraph comb, that's what we want. Oh, but Wind Slash has double, so I need to keep that. The black and white megaphones both have double. Interesting. If I could sell the green one. Why is everyone jealous of Catwoman's boyfriend? Why? Why is everyone jealous of Catwoman's boyfriend? <clears throat> no, not- I wanted to talk to the lady, not the turtle's paradise. There we go. He gets lots of pussy. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, that one's that one's uh, that one's silly. Almost too obvious. Okay, we saved. Uh, okay, okay. All right, I think that's everything for Cosmo Canyon. We can uh, we can go to the next we can go to the next area. All right, let me just double check where that is. Okay. All right. What did Catwoman say to Spider-Man? I don't know what. Come on, show me the map again. There we go. All right, we are headed to the north. To the next town. It's the only other town we can reach right now that we haven't been to, I think. Don't bug me. <laughs> Spider-Man probably would bug Catwoman, for real. Oh, 
Okay, the dot is like, yeah, up here? Okay, here we go. Now this looks familiar, doesn't it? Okay, let's uh, get out of the buggy. What is this? Oh my gosh, we've been here before. We've been here before. This is Nibelheim, right? But the town's all here. Yeah. Cloud, did you lie to us? I'm not lying. I remember. The intense heat of the flames. And Tifa didn't say anything. Y'all, Tifa knew, and she didn't say anything. Okay. Let's go around uh, Nibelheim. Let's see what's going on. Hello, talk to me. Okay, uh, this is... Oh, this is the inn. What's your story? This town was supposed to have burnt down five years ago. What the hell's going on? Sir, don't say such awful things. I was born and raised in this town. What you say never happened. Okay. I mean, we knew Cloud was crazy, but like... What? What about this guy? Man in a black cape? He has a tattoo, number six. Hmm. He has something. A luck source. Or must go to reunion. Reunion? This looks just like the flashback. Nothing here. Okay, that's just potions and stuff. Well, there's another one. He has a tattoo of the number 12. Hmm, he has something. Braille, hello! Oh, an elixir. Can you hear the voice of Sephiroth? Look what part we're at. Bale, look what part. Nice town, huh? We've been in business here for a long time. You're lying. Do you have anything to do with this town? <laughs> How about being born and raised here? I was here until I was 14 and I don't remember you. Not nice to lie. Okay. Alright. This is, uh, very confusing. What is it? I want to hear your story. I lived in this house until I was 14. No, but this town was burned down. You're sick saying such things. Get out of here. Oh, there's another one. Must get it and bring to Sephiroth. Then become one with Sephiroth. Sky's number five. Jeez. It's a tattoo of the number 11. Oh, I've got a turbo ether. Must go reunion. Just notice how similar this game's music is to parts of six. Yeah, for sure. There's a lot of similarities between six and seven um, as well. You know, six is a, is a lot of people's favorites, but I think that for us in the West, um, because six is the 2D one, it doesn't get remembered the way seven does. Is Tifa's piano. 
but I definitely remember playing the piano then. So why wasn't it burned down? Go for it. Now how did this go? All right. We played on the piano. Just like before. Oh, there's another one. Tattoo number four. Got a platinum fist. Okay. Where are you, great Sephiroth? Oh, a little one. Luxource. Reunion. Reunion. What the heck? None of these people think that these black figures, like, that are just, like, chilling, saying these weird shit in some dark robes are, like, they're, they don't think that's really fucking crazy. Oh my god, there's more of them. Ooh. He's calling. Sephiroth is calling. The great Sephiroth is near. Inside the mansion. Oh, the great Sephiroth. Oh my god. Okay. Well, our next stop is to go in that mansion right there. Where, um, lots of things are gonna happen. So... We are actually gonna save and end the episode a little bit early. So I can start fresh on the Sephiroth mansion tomorrow. Okay? So, I'm gonna leave you guys on a little bit of a cliffhanger. Tomorrow, we will get together, and we will find out what the heck is going on with those hooded figures, okay? All right, so if you're watching the recorded version of this, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Come back tomorrow for another episode, and of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.